This is a normal introduction to your standard video essay. I point out a contrasting idea with the video topic. I use a grounded scenario to help visualize it, and then I make a relatable comment and ask for you to subscribe. This is your normal video. I am your normal host. There is nothing wrong. We're best friends, and this is how I always act. I would never be an imposter who's taken your friend's place, because imposters don't exist. Haha, <laughs> Among Us joke, right? Now let me into your house. So yesterday, a friend of mine on Discord asked if I was currently at their front door. And I was so confused by that, you know, for multiple reasons, because, like, I never leave the house. We, like, me and that friend lived multiple states away, and it was, like, the middle of the night. Y you know, why on earth would I be at their front door, right? So I basically said that, and they were like, yeah, y yeah, I know. But, like, look at this. And then they showed me this, like, security cam footage from, like, the front door. And it was literally me knocking on their door and, you know, asking to be let in. And it was weirder, too, because, like, me in the video, like, the colors would get lighter or darker in an unnatural way. And, like, the vocal tone, my voice, you know, would shift in ways that weren't really human. And, you know, I kind of replied back because... You gotta keep in mind, it was April 1st when this happened. You know, April 1st, midnight, right? Just turned April 1st. I thought they were, you know, getting a slick kind of laugh in, but no, no, they, they were serious. Because I, I was like, oh, this is pretty good. Uh, do you think I could post this on my YouTube channel as, like, my creepy pasta, you know, free content, right? And they were like, buddy, do you honestly think I'm joking here? Do you think I have the ability to make something like this? And, you know, obviously they don't because they're a jackass, right? So I was like, well, yeah, I know you don't, but it, like, if it's not fake, then what is it? And they, they were just like, I, I don't know what it is, but I don't want to go out there and find out what it is. And, you know, it was still knocking on the door at that time. And I guess the real horror started to kick into me at that point in the conversation. I'm like, oh, they're, they're fucking not joking. Oh, okay. So I had to lock in, and I told him, okay, you want to grab your nearest salt that you have and lay down a line of it in front of the door the thing is currently at. And you also want to lay down lines of salt in front of any other doors and windows that they can get in from. And they did that, and then after they did that, they commented about how the voice started deteriorating. It sounded a lot worse, and... They were banging on the door now, demanding to let in their old friend. And, you know, the, the creature was mocking them. They were, they were talking about, what, what's there outside to be so afraid of? It's just your friend. And I was like, okay, I, I get the situation is really scary. But it's commonly thought of that creatures like this feed off of your fear. So I need you to take a few deep breaths and try to calm down as much as you can. Um... And after a bit of that, luckily enough, I think like 20, 30 minutes hour later of silence, I didn't get any text back, they said that the creature left or at least stopped trying to get in for now. And I was like, that's very good, but don't be in a rush to leave because it could still be hanging out nearby. And yeah, that was a very scary situation for me to be in. I, I get I wasn't really in it, right, but you know, I was a part of it somewhat, um... I'm glad that they're okay. I hope that it doesn't come back, but I, I guess it's still just kind of on my mind and I don't really know what else to make for my channel, so I figured I might as well share that story. Um, so I guess, I guess the lesson of today's story is pretty simple. Always be extra careful if the math isn't lining up for something. It, you know, if there's something really weird happening and it seems too good to be true, definitely definitely keep your suspicions very high and you know don't be gullible um i've been your host tragedy tv and i thank you all for watching if you enjoy this style of content be sure to like and subscribe because it helps out my channel um and it encourages me to make more content like this i have a discord server in the description if you want to join it and talk to me and you know other fun and uh, friendly members of the community so yeah thank you all for watching see you in the next one